Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hi, my name is Benicia and I hope that you're here to stay. Okay, so as you can see, I've got straight hair. Your girl done gone and flat iron her hair. So, um, I wanted to do a length check and I also wanted to get my yearly trim. Now, I promised myself that when I go natural, I'm going to try to take off my hair as much as I can. And that includes getting my hair trimmed yearly. Like, I want to do it yearly. You're supposed to probably do it more than that. But I want to try to at least do it once a year for now. So, um, I flat iron my hair. And I was very careful, do not worry. And I posted a couple of pictures on my social media and people were freaking out. I got private messages, DMs and everything. People asking me, did you relax your hair? No girl, I did not relax my hair. So I'm going to show you the process in which I um, accomplish my straight hair. So I shampoo and I condition my hair with the Shea Moisture's Plantain and Yucca Shampoo. I love this product talk about I talked about this in another one of my videos I shampooed my hair with this and made sure that my hair was cleansed properly and then I just um, did a deep treatment with the mask I did that and I left this in for about 45 minutes and then I added a little bit of my Cantu leave-in conditioner just a tiny bit and then I let my hair I t-shirt dry my hair and then I let it um, air dry and then I did my stretching method, my no heat stretching method, and I did a video about how I do that. I'll leave a link in the description box below so you can go and check that out. So I did that and then um, I left my hair overnight. The next day I added a little bit of my argan oil and I just used about two drops, just a tiny bit, because I didn't want my hair to be heavy. So just two drops of my argan oil and then I applied that in my hair, my hair was dry and you will see in the video from then so what i did was i just blow dried my hair just for a couple minutes like not long at all i just used the blow dryer to get it a little bit more straighter than it was but it was already a hundred percent dry so for my heat protectant i use the tresemme keratin smooth system and i did my research first before i decided on what um heat protectant to get and this one had a lot of good reviews I saw a lot of natural people use it so I used this when I blow dried my hair and I also used it when I flat iron my hair and I only went over my hair flat iron my hair two two times I did not go, go over it more than that after I flat iron my hair you would see in the video um, I realized that I did need to get a trim and my hair wasn't you know I was so scared so my hair wasn't lying as flat as I wanted it to and the ends were like split basically I needed a trim so uh, yesterday I went and I got a trim and I also got my hairdresser to wrap my hair with a wrapping method and yeah this this is the result and this is the day after I had my hair cut last night I wrapped it up myself and that's just how I went to bed so this this is the result now my hair feels extremely soft my hair is healthy so yeah I'm planning to keep this in for a couple weeks hopefully it can last that long and I will document this process of me keeping my hair straight and what I do to keep my hair as straight as possible so um, yeah I'm pretty sure I don't have heat damage so don't worry about that I'm not worried about it because I was extremely careful and I'm not gonna be using heat again I already put away my blood dryer I, would, I already put away my flat iron so there would be no heat in my head again until next year I promise you that so yeah, this is my hair flat iron. I'm gonna show you the back. Well, this is the side. This is the side. This is the other side. And this is the back. And um 
my hair, I know it looks like my hair is cut in a style or bob style or whatever but um, you would see um, in the upcoming clips that my hair, this is just how my hair grows since I've known myself, since I've had relaxed hair, I've always had a bang, like always, my hair always grows like this, like slanted like that, it just, it does not just grow straight, it's had the hair just a clip and it was not even half of an inch that came off of my head. Probably some parts, probably an inch because some parts were longer than some, but no more than that. So um, if you want to see the process by which I fat iron my hair, just keep on watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye!